Uh, one reason that I wanted to go to Turkey for many years was to go to the Rumi shrine. I love Rumi's poetry. I've, uh, I think his way of understanding God and love, the friend, um, that uh, mixture of ecstasy and agony uh, that are both recognized and celebrated in his uh, poetry and religious vision uh, made me want to go to see where he was most celebrated in Konya. And walking through uh, the shrine there was indeed an education, but more than that was a reverential feeling uh, for this person who in the 12th century, um, uh, or was it the 13th or 14th, um, uh, found a way to um, express these amazing insights in language that still haunts us today. What do you think about Turkish people for their toler tolerance uh, that they show right now and they have shown in the past during the Ottoman time toward uh, fo followers of other religions and traditions? Well, from what I know about the Ottoman Empire, it was extraordinarily tolerant. After all, uh, Jews went to Ottoman lands in order to escape persecution from Christians. Um, the Ottomans, as I understand the history, uh, did not engage in forced conversion, uh, but rather set up small communities so that each faith tradition could be practiced within the larger empire. And I think that was uh, pretty remarkable for those days. Uh, as far as modern Turkey goes, I have some questions about it. Uh, while I am a card-carrying member of the American Civil Liberties Union and believe in the separation between church and state, it does seem to me that the uh, secular rule of Turkey has gone overboard in making it difficult for people to express their own religious tradition. I'm distressed to learn about the difficulties that women have, for example, in gaining government employment uh, or working in schools uh, if they choose to dress in a modesty that is governed by their own particular understanding of Islam. One of the things I liked about visiting uh, the mosques uh, in Turkey was that women there were free to dress as they wished, either without a, a scarf or hijab or in full purda if they chose. Um, and I think that uh, government should allow the free expression of people's uh, conscience when it comes to issues like that. What do you think, what do you think about Turkish history, culture, and religion after the Turkey trip? What did I think about What do you think about Turkish history, culture, and religion after the Turkey trip? Well, uh, I have a... Anything changed? A pardon? Is there anything that, that is changed? Well, it's fuller, it's deeper. I mean, I have had an interest in Islam, for example, for decades and often talk about the indebtedness of the West to Islam. Uh, we'll be coming up on tax season here in the United States soon, and I often challenge my less informed friends to consider what it would be like if they did their taxes using Roman numerals, and then they get it. We use Arabic numerals. Now, I realize that the Arabic numerals were actually brought um, uh, originated in India, but it was the Arab scholars who developed mathematics 
And the word zero in English comes from Arabic, uh, also the word cipher in English, uh, because the uh, Christians in the Dark Ages in the West didn't even have the concept of a placeholder. And it's very difficult to do long division or any kind of sophisticated mathematics unless you have a placeholder. And so since there was none in Western mathematics, the word zero, when that concept was introduced, also had to be introduced into European languages. Well, that's just one example. Uh, when I went to the Museum of Military History in um, Istanbul, I was reminded that it was the Ottoman Empire that developed the marching band. So again, I like to tell my American friends that John Philip Sousa, who wrote the great marching uh, band uh, songs for America, like the Stars and Stripes Forever, uh, if there had not been the precedent, the development of the marching band in the Ottoman Empire, we wouldn't have this great American music. Uh, we have Starbucks now everywhere in the United States. Well, where did coffee come from? The very word itself. Uh, comes from Islamic culture. So, um, uh, in, in so many, many ways, in medicine, in mathematics, in navigation, in biology, um, uh, in meteorology, uh, our indebtedness is great. So, going to Turkey and being able to see some of that, uh, for example, um, uh, going to the um, uh, school um, uh, out uh, near the modern city of Bergamum, uh, Bergama, uh, where we saw uh, where uh, Galen, uh, I believe it was, studied and practiced, a huge site with, uh, for those days, sophisticated medical procedures. Uh, the um, uh, the hospital of Asclepius, named after the Greek god of healing, uh, it was quite quite impressive to have such a large site devoted to medical practices. Well, and that influenced the West for a thousand years, a thousand years, and as late as Martin Luther's time, Martin Luther, the great a uh, Protestant reformer said he would rather be operated on by an infidel butcher, meaning a Turkish uh, bur a butcher, than a Christian doctor, because the medicine amongst the Turks was so much more advanced. Now things have changed, uh, but I will say, uh, and this may not make it on your videotape, but I was impressed with the plumbing in modern Turkey, having a built-in bidet where almost everywhere I went, in a hotel or a restaurant or a home, that is um, an advance in cleanliness and comfort that is rare in this country yet. So. It, that's one kind of uh, homely way of talking about um, some of the things I learned from the trip. Did Aaron bring ideas to you about new activities and projects of your faith dialogue? Well, it was important to see the tremendous investment that people connected with the movement of Futella uh, Gulen um, uh, have made in order to help people understand what at least Turkish Islam is like and to bring people from different faith backgrounds together in conversation. So that was impressive to me. I could not have gone to Turkey except for that kind of, of invitation. And that work, of course, as you know, is continuing in this country.